Hi, welcome to the how-to series. Uh, this, this is, tutorial is just a little short one to show you how to add a design into your Scan and Cut. This is the DX model that I'm showing you on. Uh, it's very similar on other models as well, but we'll just we'll work with the DX on this one. Um, remember to like and subscribe to my channel. Also have a website, createwithsue.com. So we'll just get into the video. So you can see we're in the home screen, so you'd press home to get to this screen. And down here you can see retrieve data. So that's where you go to retrieve your data. So you've got four options here. It can be on the machine. It can be by Wi-Fi. It can be on your USB. Or it can be on your computer connected to the, your scan and cut in the DX model. Not so much in the CM range. Um, I put a USB in just to, to show you how that works. We'll go into the USB. And then I'll just go back. These are all different folders. I've got my embroidery folders on there as well. You can see this one here, Scan and Cut. And it'll go and look and see what's in there. I don't want what's in that one. Let's go back. And we'll scroll down. You can see these are SVG files. It's a Christmas tree, sunflower, card, sunflower. Uh, this one here is a pattern. We'll go into that one just to see what it is. There we go, happy. So if I was looking for that one, you'd just remember what you've called it. Happy and you're in. So if you go, oh, I don't want that one, you can either go back or you can trash it, whichever you like. Um, trashing may remove it from the USB. I haven't, don't you really use the trash. Uh, we'll just go into this one here, see what that one is. Uh, and you can see that's a, a door card, and that's got a door that will open. Something I've designed. Just how we want to cut that, we've got OK. And then we have the ability to add more pieces to this design or to edit and uh, edit the object in here. And we'll do that in a different video. And to change some settings and to scan. You can scan your mat. So we'll, we'll actually press the scan. And the scan. And I've got a black sheet on at the moment. So that's going to be a little hard to see. Very quiet. But if you can't see, you can go into, I'll just go back from that. You can go into the wrench and change your background setting. You go OK. And see that black car, uh, back vinyl is now a grey colour. And you can move your design over to suit. So we go OK. I'll wash to cut that. Go up here, select whether you want to cut or draw, go cut. Now I've got vinyl in, so I've got half cut on, so that would be fine. If you want to know how to do the half cut setting, there's another video on that. Uh, half cut on, and you could do a test cut if you want, or you just, just go start. Okay, very easy. So that's from the USB. So, but what if you wanted to use one, just cancel that, go okay. What if you want to use uh, one from Wi-Fi? So this one here, hopefully I've got something in my Wi-Fi memory. Whatever I did last. Can't remember what that was actually. So it's gone off to retrieve it from my network. And it's a card. So you can see that there. Once again, it needed the light. You can actually turn that right off as well. And that just shows you on the map. But then you can't see where you've got your materials. So go back on, we'll put it on light and OK. And you can see that it's on the material. Could perhaps move it up a little bit. So you go OK. Once again, select. Go cut. And then do a test or start. And I've already tested, so I would just choose start. 
Now, let's go back to home again. So, okay to do that. And if you wanted to choose something from your scanning cut, you would go into that screen there and work your way around until you found what you wanted. This little back button. Your Disney ones if, you, if you're on a Disney model. And borders, wording. And you would just pick something. Something that you liked. Your words in there. And borders. So just say so we wanted that set. Move it down a little bit so it's on your on your materials. And you'd go OK. Once again, cut or draw and start. Easy as. All right. Don't forget to subscribe and createwithsue.com for more tutorials. Thanks. See you next time.